exploring past and future from the magnificent timeless present. Welcome, welcome, dear human. We are so pleased to be with you again. And we'd like to go a bit deeper into the subject of time, the past, present and future. Our channel asks the question if we could give insights about things happening now and whether things that happened or will happen in the past and future can be experienced and how. Where you really are in time and space. We know that as we explained in our previous message about time, that many of you think in a linear way about the time that passes, the years or months that go by. And you look to the future as if you're following a line that goes from where you are now to where you want to be in a certain amount of time, or at a certain place. Because in all honesty, everything that we say about time also applies to place or space. When you go from one place to another, you look at it as if you draw an imaginary line from your starting point to your destination. But there is no other place than where you are at this moment. And when you move, or apparently seem to move, all that actually moves are your surroundings, your decor. You don't really move, because there isn't really something as a time or place. You are always here and now, always. Living in the illusion. But to be able to live your physical life in the hologram or the illusion, if you will, you have to have the sensation of going somewhere. So when you move, it feels as if your body moves away from a place that you were in just yet. When you step into your car, it looks and feels as if you're moving from A to B. But you aren't in reality. You actually have never moved anywhere since the day you set foot on this planet. Remember that you are energy. You are source energy. You are the all that is. The all that is, source, God, whatever name you'd like to give it, is omnipresent. It is in everything, and it is everything. So when you as a human being go somewhere, or time passes, in reality, nothing happens. You are always there where you are, here and now. But the surroundings you experience, the sense of passing time that you have, are an illusion to make your human life, your stay on planet Earth, as plausible as possible, as real as possible. Glimpses of reality We understand that this can be hard for you to grasp, and we don't blame you for that. From a human perspective, this all sounds like science fiction and doesn't seem to be real. But sometimes there are glimpses, or insights, that show you that it's true. Sometimes you experience time passing without you noticing it. You go somewhere, and while you know the amount of time on the clock that it would have to take, you are at your destination in an instant. Or you manage through being in your highest level of consciousness in a higher vibration to focus yourself from place A to B without noticing how you really got there. These things happen more often than you realize. And these are the things that will begin to happen more often for more and more people. Change of how you perceive time and space. Because the collective consciousness of humanity is rising to a higher level, even if you can't see it yet, there are things happening, your bodies are changing, your awareness is growing, your vibration, as well as the Earth's vibration, is rising. So your experience of time and space will begin to change. You will become more aware of things that have happened or will happen from being in the now moment you will be able to see other timelines, timelines that you call past and future. You are right now, as we speak, already able to communicate with those timelines. You can consciously connect with your future self, ask them questions about things that you are now facing, with them answering you how they got past these things from a future perspective. Or you can communicate with your past self, to encourage and comfort them and give them perspective from where you are now. This may sound weird, strange, futuristic, but we are not joking. Every human being has the ability to do this, to channel your past and or future self. Connecting from the here and now to past or future. Because all there is, is here and now. There is no time, no space, no separation, 
No difference between the you from back when, now and then. It's all you, always, and always available to you. You are one with your past self, your present self and your future self, as you are one with all that is. You are all that is. So can you experience what happened in the past or what will happen in the future? Yes, you can. And many humans already tap into this frequently. When you go from your head into your heart, focus yourself, visualize yourself going from your head into your heart and you take a few deep breaths, you are able to step into any world, any place, any time that you wish. Because it's all here. Your heart space is your portal and you have it with you always. So try this. This is enough for you to chew on for now. Remember who you are. We love you, dear human, and we are sharing our messages with you to help you see the reality of your human existence, to see the bigger picture, to see and remember the real you, the God that you are, the power that you have, the magnificence that is you. We are one, we are you, you are us. There is only love and oneness. We love you, we love you, we love you. We are the collective consciousness of all that is, and with that, we are complete. <laughs>